Guess who got a kitten? And his name is Gunther. Nope, we didn't adopt a kitty. We didn't rescue a kitty, but someone we know very well did. Stay tuned. Just got to Kate's house, and guess what Kate got? Look. Oh, you are so cute. Well, I'm a grandfather to this kitten. This is Gunther. And Gunther was adopted by Kate and David. We're at Kate and David's new house. Gunther actually has a pin in his leg because when he was a kitten, it was a broken femur and they pinned it back together. They meaning the shelter. And Kate and David adopted this cute little guy. I'm just now meeting him for the first, this is the very first minute that I've seen him. We just walked in the door. And they adopted him. They went to the pet store, not the pet store, they went to the uh, rescue place. Which one? Where did you go? Uh, Headwaters Humane. Humane, Humane Society. Humane. Headwaters. Headwaters Humane Society. Kate and David went to Headwaters Humane Society to look at the dogs. They were considering maybe getting a third dog. And they walked out with Gunther. <laughs> Super surprise. Super surprise. But, I mean, who could resist this face? He's a lot like, like our cats. Very much so. Very much like Mason was when Mason was little. And extremely a lot like Coho. Oh, you are so adorable. I see why you walked out with him. So, he has a pin in his hip here. I love when he walks, he like grabs the floor. <laughs> if, you, if you watch his, his feet. He like, does that to my leg. Look at this when he comes up. He, he, does he that spreads his feet out. Mm -hmm. Listen to him purr. Yeah, he purrs, he purrs oh, louder than Coho, I think. Which is amazing. Cause, so... <laughs> You're a proud new mama of Gunther. Yeah. You're grandma, Karen. Well, again. Again. Oh, grandkitty. Grandma. Oh. You, we don't have any grandkitties. <gasps> we don't. Until now. Kitty. So now I'm, I've got a grand kitty and a grand chameleon and a grand something lizard. Lizard. Where's the grand chameleon? The grand chameleon's in here. Does does your cat doesn't bother him or? Does it... Oh, I got a video shot for you. <laughs> She's ready for Halloween. Look what don't Kate pop, has. Don't pop off at me. I know you're eating. You're fine. Are you guys best buddies? So can he protect himself? Oh my. Look at this. A kitty and a... Bearded dragon. Bearded dragon. They've met before? Jeez. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, this is funny. Did you just meet a bearded dragon? Could the dragon hurt? I don't know anything he's about it. He's got, he, yeah, he's got pretty sharp talons. Oh, yeah. So if he wanted to do some damage, he could, but he's pretty chill. He's like, film me. I want to be on Frosty Life. <laughs> so I have a grand bearded dragon. Oh, oh. No, we don't want to lose a bearded dragon. Uh, David wouldn't be happy with me. <laughs> this is David's longest pet. He's had him for six years. Really? Mm-hmm. <laughs> that is hilarious. Mm -hmm. What do you think? What do you think of that, Gunther? Yeah. So does the bearded dragon, does he do camouflage too? No. <laughs> Should I hit him or not? <laughs> You have a casualty, Caitlin. Oh, yeah. His eyes are plucked out. Yeah, that's right over, yeah. <laughs> so we're in Kate and David's new house. They just moved in. And if you haven't been watching for the past month, they got married a month ago. Not even. Just barely. Yeah. Oh, Vermont. don't choose Dale. He's our... He's our one month anniversary gift to each other. Because <laughs> we didn't even realize Debbie had to text us and be like, happy one month anniversary. And I'm like, oh, okay. 
Can't go that way, buddy. No kidding. They're going to be best of buds. A bearded dragon and a tabby. There you go. <laughs> All right, bud. Well, that's Ow. kind of fun. Uh. So, I'm a proud new grandpa of a Gunther boy. I love that name. There you are, you two Balonians. Kitty kitty. There you are, frosty friends. You now see my <laughs> grand kitty. That's our grand kitty. Well, well look who jealous. wants some attention. All I see is ears sticking up. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody's jealous. Yeah. Yeah. He's a bit jealous. Well, she's should, like, you haven't taught, come home at all today? How dare you? Should we come and pay attention to the puppy? Or not? I gotta get my shoes on. Hi, Rolo. Hi, boy. Yeah, so you happy to see Grandpa? Yes. Yeah, sorry. Uh, you need attention, too. <laughs> yeah, it's a good boy. Huh? Who's a good boy? Huh? Ooh, so you're all wet. Yeah. No, stay down. Ah, I'm gonna get me muddy. Nope. Good boy. Good boy. Where's the toy? Where's the toy? Look. Bring it here. Here. Who's this Sadie? Sadie traveled with us in the new truck. Everything's new lately. Oh, and Kate's car got wrecked up. David hit a deer the other day on the way to work. So there it is, just like my Suburban, smashed up front end. He's already bought a new headlight and it's taped in place until they can get the inside mechanism, which costs $62. And then he'll install that. But he's got a heated garage to get that fixed. So it's raining out. Luckily it's not snowing. Sadie's on the road with the new truck I showed you the other day on my other video. Rollo boy! You want me to throw that ball? Look at Kate and David's new yard. This is a lot of space. Lots to mow too. So we picked up a, uh, they found a used lawnmower that doesn't run. They're gonna fix it. Then we got a snowblower. Bring it here, Rollo boy. Come on. Don't go bye bye, Sadie. Check it out, Cub Cadet. We hauled it to the house and got a Cub snow or a Cadet snowblower. I think it's the same. It's got to be the same company, Cub Cadet and Cadet 286. How's that look? It's rusty but trusty. <laughs> Kate's gonna be clearing the yard and no, blowing David. the snow. That's David. He said he's in charge of the yard. Oh yeah? yeah? You don't get to do it? I mean, I could if, he, if I wanted to, but... You could go drive around and do donuts in the driveway. I don't think so. Yes! <laughs> I raised you right! You gotta do donuts!